Hey everyone, we've made it to week eight of reading through the Bible in a year. Today's readings are Leviticus chapters 8 through 11, Psalm 110, and Hebrews chapter 4. Now in this video, we're going to be in Hebrews chapter 4, and this is a continuation of what we read yesterday in Hebrews chapter 3, when we're talking about the Israelites losing faith in God, and their punishment is that they have to wander in the desert for 40 years. In chapter 4, verse 1, it says, Therefore, since the promise of entering his rest still stands, let us be careful that none of you be found to have fallen short of it. Now, I try hard not to repeat myself in these videos and try and find something different to talk about each time I do one, but the topic of spiritual maturity is a repetitive theme, and again, we're talking about that today. It is so important to have spiritual maturity. It protects us from losing the rest we have in God, which is eternal glory with him in heaven. Also, like we're told in Matthew chapter 19, verse 24, it is easier for a camel to go through the eye of a needle than for someone who is rich to enter the kingdom of God. Hebrews 4, verse 6 echoes that statement. It reads, it still remains that some will enter that rest, and those who formerly had the gospel preached to them did not go in because of their disobedience. With all of that being said, don't be afraid to pray to God for strength. We are guaranteed to face trials in this life, and we can be confident that God is with us at all times. As verse 16 in Hebrews chapter 4 says, approach the throne of grace with confidence so that we may receive mercy and find grace in our time of need. That's all for today's readings. Tomorrow's are Leviticus chapters 12 through 14, Psalm 11, and Hebrews chapter 5. See you later.